So you've got your Raspberry Pi set up and pretty much everything is running smoothly. But what if something goes wrong? Don't sweat it because backing up your Raspberry Pi's SD card is easier than you might think. Let me walk you through it. And first of all, let's talk tools. If you're rocking a Windows PC, you've got two options. You can either use Balena Etcher or the Win32 Disk Imager. Both of these can get the job done, but for this video, we'll stick with Etcher. And I've provided a link in the video description where you can download Balena Etcher. What's neat is you do have the option of getting the portable version, which means you don't have to install anything on your computer. To back up your Raspberry Pi, first let's launch Etcher. And after that, we'll select Clone Drive. Then choose your SD card that you want to back up. Now select your target destination, like a USB flash drive or another SD card. And finally hit flash and then let Etcher do its magic. Once this is done, Etcher will give you a heads up and then you can safely eject the card. Okay, so now let's say disaster strikes and you need to restore your backed up data. No problem. Just follow these simple steps. Let's go ahead and launch Etcher again and now select flash from file. You'll need to find the cloned IMG file that we made earlier. Now you'll choose your target micro SD card and then finally click flash and let Etcher do its thing. Now you can eject the SD card, pop it right back into your Raspberry Pi and then you're good to go. So there you have it. Backing up your Raspberry Pi's SD card is a piece of cake with tools like Etcher. And it might seem like a small thing, but trust me, having that backup could save you a ton of headaches down the road. So go ahead, give it a try, and rest easy knowing your Raspberry Pi is backed up and ready to go. Thanks for watching. And for more on Raspberry Pi, please consider subscribing to this channel.